today we are going to be looking at a print by the artist Wassily Kandinsky. It's called um, Squares with Concentric Circles. And to start this project, uh, I'm just going to show you how to fold up your paper. So uh, you don't really need a ruler for this. Um, we don't need to be that exact. I'm going to um, just match my edges of my paper up by folding it into thirds. This paper, mine measures 9 by 12. So by folding it in thirds this way and in half here and matching up my corners, folding it in half here and then taking the outside edges and folding it to the center here and here like a set of um, bifolding doors here I then have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 shapes just as Vasily did in his print. And um, I can use crayon, I can use colored pencil, I can use marker, I can use paints, I can use chalk for this. Um, so you decide what you have at your disposal at home and you can get started. Now, what I want to look at here is that these are not perfect circles. I don't want to worry about this. This work of art is more of a study of color, the way that colors look next to other colors. And you do not need to make your circles perfectly, and you do not need to make your circles a certain thickness or thinness. And you'll notice when you look here that there are different amounts of circles in each space. You know, for example, um, this space has one, two, three, four, five, six, and there's a really thin orange line in there, and I'm gonna call that seven. So there's seven circles in there, where in this one, there's only one, and then the blue is two, and the orange is three, and the green is four. So, um, you know, this is really more about a study of color and how color sits next to color and how that impacts the color next to it. So we're just gonna have fun with this. We're not drawing our circles on here. We're just gonna start painting our circles or coloring our circles on here. And so watch for my next video.